now we will create another example 10 JSTL in this example we will create a JSP page index.jsp we can create an array int array suppose with some index values semicolon now we will save this uh, array in the session scope session dot set attribute and the variable name is x attribute name is r we will provide a navigation link hyperlink reference pqr dot jsp we will create pqr jsp now save it pqr dot jsp in the application root save now we are going to use the jstl tag c for each where and items closing c for each tag and tagging directive now in items we will provide the session scoped attribute r this recall index.jsp the attribute name is r and the value pair is integer array so actually the value will be resolved here and with this attribute name the array of integer will resolve and one by one we will iterate over the records each time an integer record will be fetched and we will save that record into the page scope attribute naming w suppose and now we will just print that attribute value w an attribute saved into page scope and we are now accessing that what is the value which is paired with this page scope attribute w so we are accessing one record each time so the array records will print one by one now you can run and test this example 10 jstl 10 underscore jstl enter click over the link all the records published you can add some more records here 45 comma 89 save now what is new in this example i'm going to introduce a new attribute here var status and you just need to declare a variable here x and uh, what is the use of this variable see we were printing the records and we just need to insert a br tag and uh, right now i'm going to access the el and i'm saying x dot count so we created a new attribute var status and assigned a value x this variable will help us to count how many iterations have been performed so how to use this variable x simply i used el here and in this el i'm specifying that var status variable x and there is a property naming count so x dot count that uh, the count starts from one here i just placed a dot and space to properly show the records now let's try it again back the index page click over the link and now you can see that all the records 12 34 56 78 but before that i'm uh, just printing the loop counter variable one two three four five six so so far we learned three attributes where items and where status